Okay, these will be some instructions on how to make a funnel. The idea behind the funnel is you have an entry ramp, marble comes in and spirals around, and then we'll roll down through the hole. You will use transparent tape, but what I've done here is I've used black tape everywhere so you can see where the tape goes on the funnel. So yours will look a little bit better than this. To make the funnel, you get the funnel template sheet, and this will make one funnel. You're going to cut out all the pieces along all the dark lines, including the circle here and the line there. So you'll be left with, left with these pieces here. Okay, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to draw, 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 you want to make sure that when you draw on the lines, you press hard enough so you can feel the lines on the back of the paper. It'll give you a nice crease that you'll need later. The next step is to pre-fold your creases. So I've drawn these lines, and now it'll be really easy to fold all these pieces up. So I'm going to fold them all. This will make it easier to work with later. I'm going to fold up all these as well. and that'll save me time and effort later. To start the funnel, I'm going to start with the floor of the funnel. So I'm going to take my paper that I have, and I've got this cut along that dark line, so you can see how it's cut. And I'll bring it together so that the arrows match up. And I'll take a piece of tape. Now normally you would use clear tape, but I'm using this dark tape so you can see where my tape goes. So I've got two pieces that I'll use here. Okay, next part of the funnel is going to be the wall. The wall is going to be built in three pieces. The first piece is that long piece with those little cuts out of it. And I've already put some tape on here. Again, normally you would use transparent tape, not the dark tape, but I want to show you what I'm doing. So I'm going to put it here on the edge, put a piece, and I'm putting a piece of tape down about every three spots. And then I'm going to work my way around with the tape. So now what I've done is I've taped down, skipping these little teeth pieces here that I'm going to clip onto the funnel floor. And that becomes the wall. And I just need to sure it up by adding tape to the rest of the pieces. Okay, so I've gone back and I've added the tape to the other little tabs. And I've got the short piece. I put a piece here on the first and fourth tab. I'm going to kind of follow that pattern put another piece. Then I'm going to hold it in place on my funnel so it matches up and start sticking these little tabs down. Once they're all added, I'm going to go back and add missing pieces of tape to stick all the tabs down to the funnel. So now I've got to go back, finish up, and then go back. At this point, you can see that I've added tape to finish up all the little tabs and tape them all on there. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to put on the little entry ramp. So here's my little entry ramp. I've already put a little piece of tape on the inside of it. And that's going to stick right here on the edge. And then I can swing this around and I'll tape it into place by taping the bottom little tabs. At this point, I've got the entry ramp on here. And on the bottom side, I've put all this tape on here to tape the little tabs and the edge and I put some more tape right around here and I put some tape over here on the top part of the wall to hold it in place. Now I gotta put a flap in here, the marbles will come around and hit the wall. So here's my little funnel flap. I've already put some tape on it and I'll just hold it in place 